Morning, Amy. Hello, Bananas. Where are you taking all that junk? I'm recycling it. Recycling? It's the Cuddles Town Recycling Day. Today we get rid of all the old things we don't want anymore. And send them off so that they can be turned into something useful. That sounds like a good idea, B1. Morning, Bananas. Morning, Morgan. <gasps> That's not a step. Ah! was fun. Where are you taking it all? Down to the dump. I wish we had a truck to carry it in. Don't worry, Teddies. We don't have a truck, but we've got the next best thing. A wheelbarrow. And you can borrow it. But first, we have to take our junk for recycling. See you later, Teddies. Ready, B1? Off we go. Careful, B1. Don't let it fall, B2. Bit more. This way. Now this way. I think we've got it, B1. Good work, B2. Next stop, the dump. Good morning, bananas. Good, Good morning, morning Cannon Bear. Look out, B1. Out of the way. Oh, dear. You know what you need? A truck! Exactly! Bye, Bananas! Cameron Bear's right. We do need a truck. But where can we find one? Maybe Rat will know. Oh, I don't know. I'll take forever to carry all this to the dump. Morning, Rat. Are you recycling your old junk too? Oh, yes, I love recycling. Oh, uh, I, I don't suppose you'd like to do me a favour and take this to the dump for me? We'd love to help, Rat. But maybe you can help us first. I can. We're looking for a truck. A truck? To carry everyone's junk to the dump. We thought you might know where one was. As a matter of fact, Bananas, I do have a truck. Where? Right there. But that's a pile of junk. It might look like a pile of junk, but it's really a truck. A do-it-yourself truck. Do-it-yourself? You take all those pieces and put them together, and a beautiful truck appears. We knew you could help us, Rat. And because you're my very special customers, you can have everything you need for just... Two munchy honey cakes. We can? Wow. Thanks, Rat. <laughs> we, we don't know what we'd do without you. Oh, and believe me, I don't know what I'd do without you, Bananas. <laughs> oh, my wheelbarrow's out the back. Feel free to use it to take all this rubbish, uh, uh, I mean, these superb truck pieces, back home. Thanks, Thanks again, Rat. I'm a rat, I'm a rat, I'm a very clever rat. Where should we start, B1? Why don't we start at the beginning, B2? Good idea. Let's get our tools. Hammer, spanner, glue stick and tape. Everything we need to make a truck. Hmm. Do you think it looks like a truck, B1? Not really, B2. Let's try again. What about this, B2? It looks more like a dinosaur, B1. Definitely not a truck. I think we'd better try again. That looks like a truck to me, B1. Definitely a truck, B2. But something's not quite right. Let's see. Wheels. It's got wheels. Seats. Yes, it's got seats too. A horn that goes ha <laughs> ha. The horn's fine. But something's missing. What could it be? Paint! We need to paint our truck. But what colour will we paint it, B1? What else, B2? Yellow, of course. 
I can't wait to see the banana's new truck. Wow! Great job, bananas. Hello, Morgan. Do you like it? It's banana-tastic. Let's take it for a drive. Then hop in. And off we go. We're not going very fast, B1. We're not going at all, B2. Maybe we're out of petrol. I'll check the engine. Engine? What engine? You have to have an engine to make a truck go. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's banana power time! Amy, look! I don't believe it! Rat! Rat! <laughs> look! Cheese and whiskers! What a great truck, Bananas! It's the do-it-yourself truck that the Bananas got from Rat! It is? But it was just my old chunk. How did they turn it into such a smart-looking truck? Wait a minute. Where's B2? Oh, phew! All that running is hard work. Running? That's how they make the truck go. We don't have an engine, so we use banana power instead. Now we can pick up everyone's junk for recycling in our brand new truck. But won't you get tired running all around Cuddlestown? I'm tired already and we haven't even started. I've got the answer. You mean you have an engine? No, but I've got the next best thing. A giant rubber band. You just wind it up with this handle and off you go. Thanks, Charlie. Ready, B1? Ready, B2. You drive, I'll wind. <laughs> don't forget to put the brake on first. Right, Charlie. <laughs> and don't wind the rubber band too tight. Otherwise, the truck will go so fast, you won't be able to stop it. Thanks, Charlie. Now it's off to help the teddies. Happy driving, bananas. <laughs> there. That's the last of it. Thanks, bananas. Let's go. All aboard, teddies. <laughs> Yay! If you no longer like gold, that old rag doll or broken bicycle, here's the clue. Make them like new. Just recycle. Let's all recycle, recycle, recycle. It doesn't have to be new. Recycle, recycle, recycle. Everything can be reused. Yay! I should have charged at least four honey cakes. Now that all our junk has been taken to the dump, we thought we'd give everyone a ride in our truck. First to go is... Camembert and Dolly. Wonderful! <laughs> it's not fair. I want that truck back. I know. All I need is a pencil and paper. Stop! <laughs> Everybody out! What's wrong, Rat? I've changed my mind. Change your mind about what? About sending the truck. Here are your munchy honey cakes back. You can't take the banana's truck. Yes, I can. Because you need a license to drive it. License? Do you have one? No. Well, it just so happens I do. That's not a license. That's just a drawing of you and a truck. Well, it's almost a license. And seeing as I've got one and no one else has, I'll just take my truck back. I'm pleased to announce the opening of Rat's super fast taxi service. Special bargain price, one munchy honey cake for a ride around Cuddlestown. Who wants to be first? Don't wind the rubber band too tight. Nonsense. I know what I'm doing. Now, who wants a... Help! 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 Out of the way, everyone! <laughs> Rat! Are you all right? My beautiful new truck. What am I going 
going to do? You have to take it to the dump. So all the pieces can be recycled. But how am I going to get all this to the dump? We'll lend you our wheelbarrow. But that'll take ages. Just think of all the good, healthy exercise you'll get. Good luck, Rat. Bye, Rat. Oh, now I'm right back where I started. Cheese and whiskers. Oh, yes. What a fine rat I am. Quite the most handsome rat in Cuddles Town. From the top of my hat and my elegant whiskers down to the tip of my magnificent tail. Morning, rat. Oh, yes. Good morning, bananas. What are you doing, rat? Actually, I was just admiring my splendid tail. Oh, it's a fine tail, all right. A very fine tail. And long. Probably the longest tail in all of Cuddles Town. Do you know what? I think you're right, Bananas. And if my tail really is the longest, then I'll hold the Cuddles Town record. What's that, Rat? You hold a record when you're the best at something. So if I have the longest tail, I have the best tail, right? Uh, uh right. right. Hmm. But to be absolutely sure, I'd need to measure all the other tails in Cuddles Town. How will you do that, Rat? I don't know. Oh, if only I had some friends who could help me. We're your friends, Rat. So we'll help you. Marvellous. But there's no need to let anyone know what you're doing. At least until it's official. Know what I mean? No. no. But we'll still help anyway. Excellent. Now you'll need this string to measure everyone's tails. And remember, no one must know what you're doing. You can count on us. Imagine it. Ready with the string, B1? Ready, B2. That's funny. I don't remember seeing those bushes before. They look like they could do with a trim, though. Where's my snippers? Snippers? Huh? Where did they go? Pedro's got a tail B2. A very curly tail B1, which will be very tricky to measure. Let's hope this does the trick. Morning, Pedro. How are you today? Oh, morning, B1. Mmm. Oh, that looks like a delicious apple. Do you think so? Mmm, yes. Are you looking for someone to share it with you? You know what, Pedro? I think you can have this whole apple all to yourself. Really? You bet. Gee, thanks, B1. My pleasure, Pedro. Bye. <laughs> oh. oh, wow! It's them, B2. If anybody's got a longer tail than rats, it'll be either Topsy or Bernard. Then let's get measuring. And I grew them all myself. Oh, how marvellous, Topsy. Hi, Bernard. Hi, Topsy. Hello, Hello bananas. bananas. Have you been looking at that big bird? What big bird? That <gasps> one up there. Uh, I can't see a bird. Me neither. It flew across there. <gasps> I still can't see it. Me neither, I'm afraid. Hmm. It seems to have flown away. Oh, well, it wasn't a very interesting bird anyway. Bye. Bye. Well, don't keep me in suspense anymore. Who has the longest tail in Cuddles Town? Let's see. Here's how long Morgan's tail is. Not very long at all, because he doesn't have a tail. Yes, yes, yes. Get on with it. And this is Pedro's tail. When it's uncurled. Definitely not as long as mine. And this is Topsy's tail. It's the longest one so far. But still, not longer than yours. <laughs> I can barely bring myself to look. Well... I think it's decided, B1. The longest tail in Cuddles Down belongs to... Tell me, tell me! Rat! Rat. Me? <laughs> Did you hear that? I won! I won! Wait here, Bananas. I'll be back in a moment. Hi, Bananas. 
What's Rat's big hurry? He's number one. The best. The best of what? Without further ado, I'd like to present myself with this ribbon in recognition of the Cuddlestown record for the longest tail. A Cuddlestown record? That's amazing. I want a record too. Can I have a record, please, Bananas? Um, Rat? rat? Well, you can't have my record for the longest tail. I've won it and I'm keeping it. But there are lots of different sorts of records. We just have to think of the things we're best at. Great! But we'll need someone to check our records. We can do that. Right, B2. Then let's get going. Can you see it, B1? It's up there, B2. And it's very high. The highest one of all. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think, Bananas? I'd say it's official, B1. Officially official, B2. The record for the highest flying kite in Cuddlestown goes to... Amy! Congratulations, Amy. Allow me to present you with the record holder's ribbon. Hooray! Now, one last dab. There. What do you think? Hooray! <laughs> It's a big painting, B1. A very big painting, B2. So, is it official? It's officially official. Congratulations, Lulu. You now have the record for the biggest painting in Cuddlestown. Lulu, I present you with your record holder's ribbon. Congratulations. B1? I don't think there's any doubt, B2. The record for the longest jump in Cuddlestown goes to... Topsy! Well done, Topsy! Yay! Whoa! Whoa! Well? I think he's done it. I think he has, B2. Pedro, you have the record for the muddiest pig in Cuddlestown. Oh, yes. Oh, I knew I could do it. Congratulations, Pedro. Hooray! My turn. Can I go next, can I? You bet, Morgan. What would you like to be best at? Running. I'm always good at that. Running it is. Right, Morgan. Are you ready to run all the way around Cuddlestown? No problem. Ready, set, go! See you soon, every... Ah! Are you OK, Morgan? Oh, my leg hurts. I can't win the running record now. Don't worry, Morgan. Just choose something else. You're good at lots of things. This time I'll get a record. I know I will. Are you sure you feel OK, Morgan? No problems. Pass me the ball, please. Right. Get ready for the Cuddlestown ball throwing record. Good luck, Morgan. You can do it, Morgan. One, two, three. Oh, dear. Poor Morgan. He tried so hard to break a record. He probably tried to break more records than anyone else. Maybe he did. Maybe he broke a record and we didn't even know it. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Morgan's record time. <sighs> it's not fair. Everyone has a record except me. Morgan, come out. We want to see you. Huh? What do you want? We'll tell you when you get here. Oh, OK. What is it? Congratulations, Morgan. Here's your record breaker's ribbon. But I didn't get a record. You got the record for trying to break records. So I did. Wow. Thanks, everyone. Now we all have our very own Cuddlestown record. Hooray! Hey, wait a minute. The bananas don't have a record yet. They should have one too. And they will. Bananas, 
you officially hold the record for being the most helpful bananas in Town. Did you hear that, V1? We've got a record too! Hooray! Now that we're all record holders, we should have a big celebration! Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Munchy Honey Cake time! And just this once, I'll give everyone Munchy Honey Cakes for free! Does that mean we can eat as many honey cakes as we like, Rat? Uh, well, uh, I don't know about that. Because we could get another record. The, the Cuddles Down record for eating the most honey cakes ever! What? It's okay, Rat. Just one honey cake each will be plenty. Oh, bananas! When did Morgan say they'd be ready, B2? Right about now, B1. It's muffin time! Morgan's making muffins for everyone. Because everyone loves them! The muffins! We know about the muffins, Morgan. That's why we're here! The muffins are missing. Missing? I put the muffins out on the table to cool. Then I went to my room and when I came back, the muffins were gone! Gone?! I know one thing about muffins, they don't have legs. Do you think someone took them? Someone in Cuddles Town? Look! Ooh! Someone left their footprints. Whose could they be? They might lead to the missing muffins. Follow the footprints! Let's go, B2. Going, B1. <laughs> Follow me. Follow him. <laughs> this way. Right, right behind you, Morgan. These tracks head for the farm. The farm? With our farm friends. There! Pedro! And look at his feet! Oh, oh no! Huh? Oh, what? Do you know anything, Pedro? Uh, no, what? What are you talking about? The muffins! Muffins? What muffins? So what happened exactly, Pedro? You said to come over to have a muffin, Morgan. So I came over. Then you did come into the kitchen. That's how you left the footprints. But I didn't see any muffins. You mean they were already missing? That's right. You have to believe me. We believe you, Pedro. Because you're our friend. Aren't you forgetting something, Bananas? What? The pie. Remember the time you baked a pie and Pedro snitched it? That's right. He ate the lot. Hmm. OK. I admit, I did once take your pie, but I didn't take any muffins. I promise! OK, Pedro, we believe you. If you didn't see the muffins... You didn't see them, but we still have no muffins. How did they go missing? 
Do you think the teddies really believe me? Of course they believe you, Pedro. Just like we believe you. Oh, if only someone could find those missing muffins. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Detective Bananas time! We have to solve this mystery, B2. And to solve a mystery... You need clues. Clues. What sort of clues? Hmm... Crumbs! Signs, look for clues, stay alert for any news. Be on guard, ears to the ground, listen hard for any sound. Banana detectives, banana detectives were on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives Whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history Banana detectives, banana detectives No case too hard to crack Soft of tread, shh Soft of voice Creep along and make no noise Sneak about, stay in disguise, and never ever get caught by surprise. Banana detectives, banana detectives, we're on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives, whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history. Banana detectives, banana detectives, no case too hard to crack. too hard to crack. No crumbs anywhere, B2. Hmm, what should we do, B1? We should ask everyone a question. Right, uh, what question? Where were they when the muffins went missing? Where was I? When the muffin disappeared. Do you have any clues? Well, uh... I was in Rat's shop when the muffins went missing. I don't have any clues. Uh, what are you doing? Looking for crumbs. Hmm, no crumbs, B1. Then we'd better check out Lulu. When the muffins went missing, I was outside in the garden. You didn't see anything, Lulu? You don't have any clues? I'm sorry, but I didn't see anything. And I don't have any clues. Hmm. Hmm. No crumbs. Me? Sorry, Morgan. We have to check everybody. They were my muffins, Bananas. If I knew why they were missing, they wouldn't be missing. That's a good point, Morgan. So you don't have any clues? Any clues at all? I don't have a single clue. Crumbs. Crumbs. Crumbs! Crumbs? Oh, they're crumbs from the toasted cheese sandwich I had for lunch. Mmm, toasty. Cheesy. Definitely not muffin crumbs. Mm. We're sorry, Pedro. We can't find any clues. With no clues, we can't solve the mystery. Oh, you did what you could, Bananas. Thanks for trying. And thanks for believing me. <laughs> Hi, Detective Bananas. How's the detective work going? Not very well, Lulu. We haven't found any clues. We don't know how the muffins went missing. Hmm. Well, did you ask Morgan to act out what he did when he made the muffins? Did we do that, B2? Uh, no, I don't think we did, B1. 
Maybe you can find out something new that way. Great idea, Lulu. We'll ask Morgan to do that right now. Wait for us! Show us what happened, Morgan. Right from the start. Which is the best place to start? I mix the muffins up, put them on a tray, and put the tray in the oven. What did you do then? Don't leave anything out. Hmm, the muffins baked, and when they were ready, I took them out and put them on the table. And then? I, I, I made some icing for the muffins. I went to the cupboard to get some sugar. See, this sugar right here. I forgot to put it back. Huh? Ah, oh, the muffins! <gasps> the missing muffin mystery is solved. Because the muffins aren't really missing. But I, what did I do? I think we know. You took the sugar out of the cupboard. When you did that, you put the muffins into the cupboard. Then you went to your room and forgot what you did. That's when Pedro came into the kitchen. He looked all over, but there were no muffins. Then he left, just like he said. Just like we believed him. I feel terrible. I didn't really believe Pedro when he said he didn't know anything. You can make it up to Pedro. And you can do it right now. I will. Will you forgive me for not believing you, Pedro? No problem, Morgan. Thanks, Pedro. And thanks to the bananas for solving the mystery. It was nothing, Pedro. Nothing that good detective bananas wouldn't do. Give Pedro his surprise, Morgan. I am. I am. We've got you a present, Pedro. Fresh muffins. And they're all yours. Muffins? Oh, my favourite. Fantastic. Oh, thanks, Teddies. Another mystery solved, B2. By the Detective Bananas, B1. Yeah! Oh, bananas! bananas. This rat leaves some excitement in his life. Good morning, rat. Isn't it a lovely day? If you say so. Have you heard the news? Dolly's painting a shed blue. That should look fun. Have you heard the news that Charlie's got a new TV? How wonderful. Oh, there's so much happening in Cuddlestown. We should have our own news show. What a great idea, Camembert. And we could watch it on Charlie's TV. A new show? On TV? Now that is exciting. And who better to do it than me? Oh, then I could be a TV star. <coughs> Hello, Cobblestown, and welcome to Rat News. Morning, Rat. What are you doing? I'm starting the Cuddles Town News Show. Ooh! There's only one problem. What's that, Rat? I don't know what's happening. I need some reporters to find the news for me. Don't worry, Rat. We'll find the news stories for you. Ready, Reporter B1? Ready, Reporter B2? Time to find the news. All the news that is the news. Look, Reporter B1. Pedro's playing in the mud. Does that look like news to you? It looks like big news, Reporter B2. It's, it's news time! Look, Reporter B2. Morgan's making a salad. It's news time! Look over there, Reporter B1. The tide's coming in and washing that sandcastle away. It's news time! Just wait till Rat sees all the great news stories we've found. 
Wake up, Brad. <laughs> We've got the news. What? <laughs> what news? All, All the, the news that, that is, is the news. news. Excellent. Well, don't just stand there. Go and get the video camera. It's news time. <laughs> hey, everybody. The news is about to start. Hello, Cuddlestown. Yay! Yay! And in Cuddlestown news today, Pedro is still in his pen, playing in the mud. <laughs> That's not news. He does it every day. And over at the Teddy's house, Morgan was making a delicious salad. But Morgan always does that. And in a Rat News exclusive, the tide came in today and washed away a sandcastle. Sensational news stories, I'm sure you'll all agree. And there'll be plenty more where those came from. This is Rat signing off from Rat News. That wasn't much. Not much at all. Well, what did you think? It just told us things we already know. Oh. That's not exciting at all. Not exciting? Telling them things they already know? <laughs> all right then. Maybe it's time to start telling them things they don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that will give them excitement, all right. <laughs> Why are we here at the park, Rat? Oh, looking for news. What else? I don't think there's much news around here, Rat. Oh, oh goodness me. What are we here? This is strange. This is amazing. What is it, Rat? I'd say it's news. That's what it is. These strange and mysterious squiggly circles are appearing all over Cuddlestown. Where did they come from? What could they be? Tune in next time to Rat News, where you hear all the real news first. Wow! That really is news! Strange squiggly circles? Oh, hello, everybody. Uh, just passing by? I don't suppose anyone saw Rat News. Are you kidding? It was excellent. Oh, how kind of you to say so. But where did those squiggly circles come from? Maybe it's space monsters. Oh, Morgan, everyone knows there's no such thing as space monsters. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure, Lulu. I'll make them think there's a space monster right here in Cuddlestown. <laughs> what exactly are we looking for, Rat? Some clues. Clues to tell us what's making the squiggly circles. <laughs> this is all too easy. It won't be long now. Five, four, three, two. Look, B1. They look like space monster footprints, B2. But I thought there was no such thing as space monsters. I think I've changed my mind. Hurry, let's tell everyone. Oh, uh, wait, uh, bananas. Uh, I've got a better idea. Let's put it on Rat News instead. Great show, Rat. The best Rat News ever. What can I say? We just report the news. We don't make it. Unless we have to. I knew it, see, Lulu? You can't have space monster footprints without real space monsters. But I still don't believe in space monsters. Footprints or no footprints. I'll only believe it when I see the space monster itself. Uh, sorry, <laughs> it's my nap time. Oh, uh, got to go. Bye, teddies. What am I going to do? Oh, they won't be happy till they see a space monster on Rat News. But that's impossible. Because there is no space monster. Wait a minute. If it's a space monster they want, then it's a space monster they'll get. Here's what I want you to do. Get the camera ready and watch out for anything unusual. Right. And I'll try to find the monster's hiding place. Be careful, Rat. Don't worry about me, Bananas. Just be ready to start filming. What a brilliant plan 
inside hatched. I wonder where the monster is. <laughs> did you hear that, B1? Yes, I did. But I wish I hadn't been to. No! <laughs> this is fun. Should we turn the camera on, B1? I think we'd better. That space monster doesn't sound very friendly, B1. Not very friendly at all, B2. It's runaway in high time! <laughs> I'm a huge space monster, and I'm coming to scare all of Kano's town! Oh, Rat, are we glad to see you? <laughs> I chased him away. That's the last we'll see of him. You're so brave, Rat. I know. Now, go and get the camera. This will be the greatest Rat news ever. <laughs> see? Now do you believe in space monsters? It's runaway in high time. <laughs> My job as a TV star is over. And now you need to say sorry to everyone. A big sorry, especially to the bananas. If I must. I'm sorry, bananas. And to everyone here. But how do we know you're not just making that up too? Just like you made up the space monster. You mean you don't trust me? No! no. Oh, all right then. To prove I'm sorry, I invite everyone back to my shop for free honey cakes and tea. Free honey cakes? From Rat? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. That's, That's a, a real Cuddles Town news story. <laughs> <laughs>